Hi everyone. Let's solve this exponential equation. We have 4 to the power of x plus 1 equal to 32. Now we're not going to take log of both sides to deal with this. And because of that, we must equate the basis. Here we have 4. 4 is 2 times 2. Then this is to the power of x plus 1. And then here we have 32, which is 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2. Okay? And then 2 times 2 is 2 to the power of 2. Then we have power x plus 1, which is equal to 2 in 5 places will give us 2 to the power of 5. Now, we can always multiply the powers. So it's going to be 2 to the power of 2 times x. That will be 2x. Then plus 2 times 1, that will give 2. And it's equal to 2 to the power of 5. Now, the reason for breaking it down like this is for us to have the same base. So now we have the same base of 2. That means that we can now equate the powers. 2x plus 2 is equal to 5. Now, 2x will be equal to 5 minus 2, and then 2x will be equal to 3. But remember that we are looking for the value of x. So, our x will be equal to 3 over 2. That is, if you divide both sides by the coefficients of x. But then, are we right in this um, calculation? The original equation was 4 to the power of x plus 1 equals 32. Now, let us put x equals to 3 over 2 in this equation. We're going to have 4 to the power of 3 over 2 plus 1. Will this give us 32? Okay, let's check. Now, 4 to the power of 3 over 2, let me deal with this separately. So we're going to have 4. Now, the LCM of this is 2. Then remember, this could be over 1, 2. So 2 divided by 2 is 1 times 3 is 3. Plus 2 divided by this 1 here is 2 times 1. We have 2, right? So this means that we... Okay, let me have this in brackets too. We are having 4 to the power of 5 over 5 over 2. And then, if you have a problem like this, you can rearrange it this way. It means that we, you are looking for the square root of 4, and everything will be raised to the power of 5 over there. Square root of 4, and everything will be raised to the power of 5. So that square root of 4 will give us 2, and it is raised to the power of 5. 2 to the power of 5 will give us 32. So meaning that we are correct to say that x is equal to 3 over 2. Thank you for watching.